The equipment you'll need to perform reproducible jointing of Volcathene and Fusion includes pipe cutter, scraper, clamps, link cables for multiple jointing, and Fusion control unit, gloves. It's important to make sure the pipe is cut clean and square. A wheel cutter is best for this job, but a carpenter's saw can be used. Any swarf should be removed. A saw is often used on larger diameter pipes. Scrape the end of the pipe equivalent to 1.5 times the depth of the socket. This is to show that the pipe has been scraped when inspecting the system prior to leak testing. Once again, ensure that all swarf is removed. Fully insert the fitting onto the pipe and mark the insertion depth on the pipe. Loosely fit the appropriate sized clamp over the hub of the socket and position flush with the end of the socket. Tighten the clamp around the hub of the socket. It's important that the clamp is tightened sufficiently to stop pipe rotation in the socket. Do not over tighten. Turn the infusion control unit on and it will follow a self test procedure. Follow the instruction on the display to connect output leads by connecting both output leads to the fitting. The unit will display the temperature and fusion time. The fusion time is dependent on the ambient temperature which is measured by the unit's temperature sensor. Press the start button and the infusion control unit will commence fusion whilst providing a visual countdown display of the time left to fusion completion. When the fusion cycle is complete, the unit will count down a 30 second cooling time. On completion, the display will read, remove the leads. Leave the joint undisturbed for at least five minutes before removing the clamp. It's possible to perform multiple joints at the same time using link leads. Connect the output leads to the fitting first, then a link lead to provide a series connection. Press the start button and the infusion control unit will commence fusion as previously shown. For information regarding the maximum number of joints and connection instructions, consult the Volcathene technical brochure. Following a software upgrade to the infusion control unit in 2015, all sizes of Volcathene infusion fittings from 38mm to 152mm are now welded at the same fusion time. Older style units, a yellow unit in a blue protective cage, cannot be reprogrammed. It's therefore necessary to use the select button on this control unit and select any size in the 3 inch to 12 inch size range, regardless of the size being welded. Then press the start button to begin welding.